start, I just want to give Squarespace a massive shout out for sponsoring today's video. From online stores to marketing tools to analytics and websites, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a great online presence. Let's get back to the video. What's going on Gas Gang? My name's Jamie, welcome back to Officially Gas. Now today I'm back with another review and this time it's in the form of this crazy Mercedes C43 with a 5.5 litre swap, tracked out, manual swap too. Guys, 400 brake on this bad boy. This is gonna be crazy. So stay tuned and let's get it. Thank you for coming down in this ultra special C43 AMG. This is um race car. Yes. But this one's got a little bit of something special about it. Yeah, it? so 4.3 factory, which um, on automatic gearbox was, was kind of okay. Um, but I've gone down the 4.5 engine conversion route, so I've done that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Um, so it's, it's, it's a 5.5, but out of, what's that come out of? Out of an E55. E55. And it's straight in. <laughs> Wiring loom, in. ECU, the whole lot, plug wow. straight in. Very unique, really. And it just transformed the car. Mm -hmm. Torque's 100 new meters more okay. over the over the 43. It's yep. about 50 horsepower more. Yeah. will take. And what what is this running now, power wise? Um. So now with the current mods, it's about around about 400. Okay. Cool. Um. But I've been on a dyno to confirm that. Yeah. Uh, yep. But yeah, so around about that. Uh, around about mods, that. Which uh, which are cams, big exhaust, uh -huh. um, ported heads, mm -hmm. and a clean and remap. On the ECU. Yeah, I mean it's a, it's a big old V8 up in in there, but I see it is a it's a stripped out car. And you, you did say that this is actually quite light, right? So factory uh, as it is on the um, on the curb, it's sixteen seventy. Okay. Um, I've managed to get down to around about twelve fifty kilos. That uh, is a weight reduction, it, isn't it? It's quite massive, isn't it? And yeah. um, most of it is through the seats, the interior. One thing about Mercedes is well, I chose a Mercedes. Is the platform is there? Yes. More than rear suspension, double wishbone front. And that's that was what I liked about this car and mm -hmm. all Mercs actually. Yeah. But the problem is the weight. Yes. That's yeah. what lets them down because they want they want the quality. They do. They're over engineered. Over engineered so, yeah. is is right, Jamie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's the reason why I picked the car. I've got to say that there's something else that's quite unique about this, and it's uh it's the gearbox, <laughs> right? Lucky enough, has gone eBay braking and that's okay. Three twenty. Okay. Straight over there. Yeah. Got all the bits. Come back on the driveway. Got the car up in the air, so I tripped it down, <laughs> and just went from there. Really, yeah, yeah, you yeah. You know, and just did a did a common sense conversion. You're saying this could be perhaps the only one in Europe running I, this I, conversion? I, I believe so. Yeah, I, I don't right. know of anybody else who runs a con runs a manual conversion swap. Mm -hmm. um, and there's a couple of guys in America who've done it. Possibly a few guys in Germany, but I'm not too sure. I don't know yeah, who they are. Yeah. I haven't spoken to anybody about it. You were saying supporting that, you've got gearbox coolers. You've got all sorts. Yeah, of Yeah, so um, gearbox cooler. Um, to run it in case it gets quite hot on, on track which it did once last year on the Nürburgring okay. and I've got a crafe diff in the back okay. it's also called for a cooler as well okay. it runs under the under the rear diffuser okay 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 um, so with that crafe diff how does it put the power down then? that was the first one I did to the car oh, really? okay um, because the open diff the traction was always kicking off and it yep. was just uh, now that uh, now the crafe diff is in there it make, pretty much makes the traction obsolete this is still running traction control, yeah. ABS and everything, right? Yeah, it's all still working. You can switch it on and off right here yep. um, through, through the factory switch. Yeah, I wanted to keep that yeah. To, to, yeah, just in case. You yeah, know, no, fair play. And who's your tuner, actually? I forgot to ask. So the tuner is by number Kleeman, okay. who are a Danish company, well-known for Mercedes builds. Uh, let's, let's move on to the wheels, brakes, and suspension on this. Okay, so um, the brakes first. Uh, the factory brakes were okay. They were two-piece with a copper pin, but I went with a six-spot caliper conversion. Okay. And the two pieces from the SLK 55 AMG. Okay. 2006 onwards. Got ya. Bolt straight on. But you've got to shorten the anti well bar to get a full lock. Okay. So I did that. Yeah. We're back to the factory. Okay. Which are quite strong. Yep. Two pieces. What's two, the C43 pop. anyway, yeah. wasn't it? Two so, pop so. with a 300 mil disc is quite decent, really. Mm -hmm. And the front's a 340 mil disc. Um, the suspension is KW Competition. Okay. All round. Um, they were great. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant KW. Yep. Big shout out to them lot. And that transformed the car on track. That was my second suspension kit. Okay. Because, you know, you go through yeah, things. Yeah, you do, and it's trial and error. And... Oh, mate, it's just, <laughs> you know, that's a killer. But once you get it, yes, I've done it. And, yeah. and that, that transformed the car. Yeah, yeah. And then the wheels are Team Dynamics, uh -huh. which are great, again, to deal with on the phone. Great people. Yeah. You know, spot on. 
a British company. My road tyres NS2 are Nan Kang track tyres AR1s. Again, cool. spot on. <laughs> Wicked. And I thought it would also be quite cool to point out to my viewers, and they will like this, that you've, you've built this car all yourself, haven't you? Yeah, pretty much. I've been a mechanic since I left school. Um, I've done all the mechanical works. Uh, um, the only thing I that was a body work in the roll cage. Fair play. Um, so the roll cage was done, done by SA Fabrication okay. in Birmingham. Great job, Steve. And then the exhaust, so I've got custom exhaust on a car. The manifold was made by Peter Exhaust in Brackley. Okay. Peter, mm -hmm. um, really good guy. He knows his stuff. Wicked. Shout out uh, to him. <laughs> yeah, definitely so. Down pipes back was made by EMP okay. um, Performance Exhaust. Yeah. Again, great guys. Yeah. But the bat box is factory, so I want to keep the look yeah, yeah. factory, not too loud as well. <laughs> keep it just right. Let's let's talk about some of the interior mods now. And uh, I mean, let, let's start, in fact, with, with the windows. We've got Perspex, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> so I got the doors out um, and then put Perspex windows in, um, open and close, get some air in like that. Yeah, it yeah. does get hot on hot day, don't get me wrong. It just aids with everything. The weight loss around here is is, is massive, you know. It's sort of seven, ten kilos a door. And um, you've got some nice seats in here too. Yeah, so we'll cover SBGs. Um, they are the best seat money can buy. Um, you, you know, you, again, it's one of the things where you, you shop around, you try and get the best price. Um, I used other brands before, but they hold you in the right places. Yeah. And, and, and I think even the squaff, um, Scoff uh, harnesses as well, okay. or top notch stuff. Because at the end, if you're on track, you want to rely on what you've done, you know. And, yep. and sometimes spending the white money gets you. Yeah, of course. You know, it gets of you. Course, back, of so. course. We've got a nice uh, iPad in the centre console there. <laughs> you know, listen, music if you can hear it, um, navigation, um, lap timers, pictures, it's all there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Nice it's a cool little uh, touch, yeah, isn't it? I think so. Cool yeah, little touch. It just makes the car. And, yeah. And it, you, you've got everything close to hand. Let's touch on some of the exterior styling mods there because we've got some wide arches and a nice wing on it, haven't we? So again, function over form. Um, I guess get a lot of tie rubbing okay. on the ring and other track days, so it's getting just peed off. Yeah. So I went, cut big, big old gap out of the arches, <laughs> stuck some wide arches on from Russia, concave arches, yeah. and there's no more rubbing. Wicked. So I can run one wide heart, one wide, mm -hmm. wider tyres now, so two knife eyes back, two five eyes front on track, okay. your 18 inch wheels. What's so the one? wing is a carbon fibre ring from eBay. Oh, okay, nice. But it's it's lightweight, full carbon, yep. and well priced. Yeah, yeah, yeah well priced. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to tell us a little bit about the uh, carbon bonnet and the uh, carbon roof too, right? So the carbon bonnet's from America, uh -huh. um, and I waited six months for it, basically to come what? from an old bit when I paid for it at six months. Jesus. Because um, it had to be made. And, and make it from scratch, there's literally. There's not many people that have this bonnet on this car, of so course, it was quite yeah. rare. To, and I think, I think after I bought one, they didn't make them no more. They were, <laughs> so they gave up. To that. And then the carbon roof was done. Yeah, to say where, because the cage was there, yep. there's a lot of strength in the, in, in the top of the car now, so it didn't yeah, yeah. strength weight, but it kept the, the middle of the bar as well. Yep, yep. But yeah, just save weight. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Wicked. Good. Good job. Yeah. Well, I think we've uh, touched yes. on it all. Bro, yes. let's go for a drive in this bad okay. boy. Wicked, let's do Thank it, man. So we are out in this crazy C43 55 engine, crazy track car, I don't even know what to call it. Yeah. And uh, mate, the revving, that V8, it just sounds epic, man. It's, it's that raw. Yeah, <laughs> it's part of the, the love for the car, it's that noise, you know. Yeah, yeah, no replacement for displacement, we're saying, yes, yeah? Yes, yes, that's right, <laughs> yeah. Um, also, I thought it would be quite interesting to ask why you've why you've why you've done this to one of these? You just don't see it. Or this is the the first one I've seen trapped out like this. Why? How comes? <laughs> I've always been a Mercedes fan, and I think the foundations are there. Yeah. Um, and, and I think that reason not many people do them. Yeah. Does that even inspire me even more to make something yeah, different? Yeah, yeah. So that's probably the basis, the, the foundation of the, of the of the mark of Mercedes, yeah. and the uniqueness of being different to Definitely. the norm. Very you know? unique. Man. Yeah. Very unique. And you've, you're saying you've had this what ten years? Yeah, ten years. Ten yeah. years. Yeah. Wow. So it's been a it's been a steady progress of kind of mods to get it to where we are, right? Rolling development. Yeah. <laughs> are you happy with where it is? Definitely. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, cool. uh, yeah. Well, that's the main thing, mate. Yeah. 
so much, guys. I hope you can hear us. This is epic. It's so raw. saying that word but it's like everything the emotion it's like obviously no sound editing we're getting yeah. the whoosh of the, the the wind coming through the windows the roar of the v8 and just the tight, how noise. The, the tight everything yeah, yeah. Well, it comes back into position like the roll is so you can feel it with your body when you're driving the car yeah. where the car is yeah. you know you've had this chassis uh, chassis, chassis tuned, tuned yes yeah Mate. one of the most important things i've done to the car <laughs> definitely this feels crazy So it is that time, it is the gassed up zero to 60s with the draggy. Now today, again, it's a little bit damp on the roads, but it, I don't know, I don't. it's, it's drying up. It's drying up. But yep. it is still a little bit damp. Um, now, rear wheel drive car, quite high powered. Okay. Um, what do you reckon? I mean, you, you're saying you've done a good time. Uh, I've before. done sub five before. You've done sub, um, sub five, so, yeah? Yeah, I'd be happy with similar. Yeah, okay. Well, you got your work cut out, obviously, yes. weather conditions. Um, to get on the leaderboard, you're going to have to be sub fives. Right, okay. So if you hit a sub five, you're on the leaderboard. But if you don't, it was all fun and games. Yes, definitely. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> definitely. Yeah. Well, let's get it. Right, guys, so it's his first attempt. When you're ready, sir, let's get it. Okay. Okay. All right, your first attempt was not that great, if I'm honest. No. Um, that was a 7.1, uh, 7.61. Okay. And that was because I think you thought you was gonna hit yes. it in, in, in second yes. there, but you didn't, you got to 56 mile an hour, yeah. and it just bounced off the limiter. So, um, are you gonna go again? Or? Yeah. yeah, I think so, yeah. All right, yeah, cool. Now I know, yeah. He's going again. So it's his final attempt. Traction control on, yeah? Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah. Um, when you're ready, let's do it. Corners, it's not a straight line beast. Yes. Although it is fast, yes. you know, on better weather conditions, it might be a, a quicker time. Yeah. Um, yeah. Regardless, I'll put the leaderboard up now so you can see. Unfortunately, I know you haven't made it on. Sure. But it's all fun and games. Definitely. And in fun. my eyes, does take nothing away from this car. No, thank you. <laughs> so, guys, I thought I'd just take a few seconds out to tell you a little bit more about Squarespace. If you're a budding entrepreneur, you just want to sell merchandise, car related, or whatever it might be, Squarespace is the place for you. With their drag and drop easy website builder, you cannot go wrong. One massive advantage that Squarespace gives you is its analytics. Previews, traffic sources, time on site, most read content, audience geography, and much more. And guys, if you're building an automotive website and you do events, you could easily add a calendar of upcoming events to your site. So guys, make sure you head over to squarespace.com right now to start your free trial. And when you're ready to launch, head over to squarespace.com backslash gas to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Let's get back to the video. Okay, we are in. 
<laughs> the sound, the whooshing, and guys, I don't even know what the sound quality is going to be like on this one because the amount of sound and, and wind noise you get through these windows is just crazy. But for me, at least, it's adding to the experience, and um, it's just going to be crazy. And this isn't on rails either, is it? So no. it's going to be, uh, no. it's going to be a fun drive. <laughs> Feel for this clutch actually because it's so strange. Ooh. Okay, all right, so we're all away. All right, second gear. Wow, that is a tight gearbox, that yeah. isn't it? Yeah, mate, that is like proper one, two, like that's yeah. a proper mechanical. All right, so we give it a blast. Second gear now. Keep on your toes. It, it literally <laughs> keeps you on your toes. And I'm telling you guys, the sound, mate, the, the emotion, I've said this before in other cars, but the emotion it invokes, just that raspy V8. Oh man. Oh, you can't man. beat that, you can't beat it. Mate. V8. I mean, traction control was probably saving my life through half of those corners. I saw it just flashing at me. Yeah. But mate, it just takes a beating and it is so direct. That's right. It takes a beating. That's how it is. Car. It likes to take a beat. Likes to take That's a beat. That's exactly what I was built it for. Proper track yeah, slag. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Likes yeah. being slapped about, yeah? Yes, exactly, exactly what. <laughs> right guys, so that is a wrap. We're ending the video here. It has just been an amazing day. Absolutely just blown away with being able to get to drive something like this. Robin, you're the man. Thank no, you thank so you, Jamie, much. Thank you, Jamie, for having me. I appreciate Mate, it. It's my pleasure, honestly. Yep. You've got a beast here. Yep. It's just everything. It's just race car. Just as I said before, the emotion it invokes is just crazy. That big V8 up front, screaming and just oh mate, everything. Yep. It's just been sick. And um, I also need to mention that you actually you've started a YouTube channel yourself. Yeah, too. it's just Robin Walsh, my name uh -huh. on YouTube. Yeah, just about the car, uh -huh. what I've done to it, yep. um, human bring laps. Okay, cool. Yep. Well, guys, I'll leave links to that in the description. So check him out. And um, if you have enjoyed today. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Make sure you go back and check some of my other content out too because I know you'll like that and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace out guys.